to this matchup of humans versus robots. You heard me correctly. Flesh and blood versus ones and zeros. It's sure to be a flame ball of a football matchup today. So we're building a robotic, vision-controlled foosball table. So the objective is to defeat a human player. Stutter step, and it's in! A perfect execution of magnificence! This is what boys dream about, ladies and gentlemen. Watch the keeper now. Flames it across an entire flock of defenders straight into the belly of the dragon. So students all try to mimic how humans play the game, and they program their ideas into their code. It actually reacts a lot faster than human. We're seeing that it's becoming a challenge for the humans to beat the AI. The defense's algorithm reads it perfectly, it's a goal! Wonderful! Look at the disappointment on his face, he cannot believe it! It's not that we need a computerized foosball table, but it is a small example of a much larger problem. Through this project, students learn the concept, how you can control machine to achieve the tasks that human can do. And the humans are fighting, they take a shot and it's good! Great shot by the humans! So we're using a camera up here. So the camera will pick up different colors on here and whenever the ball, that value, approaches the value of the middle of that rod anywhere, it will just kick it. We can calculate in the same way what our brains do almost instantly. It's exciting, you think, oh yeah, humans ultimately should always be better than the computer. We have that ability to adapt in real time. But this artificial intelligence, the fact that we can take and predictively adapt this computer in a similar fashion, we're actually struggling to keep up. Passes to midfield and he sends it with a prayer and the prayer is answered! Wonderful shot by the robots! Too much fun, <laughs> I think, for a class. But, but they work hard and very proud of them. And the mouse moves left, right, left, right through defenders towards the subscribe button. And it's clicked. Wonderful. The 